Hello everybody, this is Bill McFadden from TomePure.com and in this video we're going to take a look at the new version of Nucleus and I'll go ahead and start off with the new changes, the new instruments and then we'll get into uh, a quick overview of the entire library. So first of all, the, uh, the change, the new instruments are we have a Celeste, Tubular Bells, a Mark Tree, and then we have, in sound design, we have sub-booms were added. So let's go ahead and take a look at the percussion, which is where we have the new Celeste. And there it is. We also have a sustained with pedal and a staccato. I didn't see anything in the documentation about the sustained with pedal, but it sounds like this. It, seem, it seems that it might actually be uh, sustaining the low note or doubling it with something. It's really not sure about that. And then we have the staccato. And the next new instrument would be the tubular bells. And then the new inst the next new instrument is the mark tree. I guess the quickest way to get down there. So here we have the mark tree and notice the articulations that we have quite a few. And then next, we'll go ahead and take a look at the new change. And that would be in the sound design down here. In particular, the last category, sub-booms.
Now, for those of you who haven't seen the full library yet, let's go ahead and take a look. So the first major category, multi-patches, gives us soloists, and I already did a vid video on the soloists, and I'll leave a link in the description. Then we have strings. And as you can see, we have 16 violins, 10 violas, 6 celli, 4 double basses. And then we have combinations of violins and violas and celli and basses. And then we have the full ensemble. So let's go ahead and take it from the top. So here's the 16 violin patch. And notice we have several articulations. Uh, the modern mix has a little bit of... Um, compression and, and other effects added, which is a much better and more robust mix than the classic mix. But if you need a subtle mix, then you can choose the classic mix. But let's hear the legato. One thing you can do is you can tighten up the action a little bit, get a faster response. So let's go ahead and listen to the violas.
next we will look at the cellos. So it seems so far that the legatos are really smooth and uh, it's just a great sounding string library. Let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the basses. So next we'll take a look at the combinations. We have uh, 16 violins and 10 violas.
And then we have the six celli and four double basses. And next we have the uh, full ensemble. Also, we have a uh, vibrato control that we can use. We'll go ahead and stop here and continue this in part two of Nucleus version 1.3. This is Bill McFadden signing off from TomePure.com.